What's good, you grimy ass motherfuckers? I'm gonna do a pick a card tarot reading for you today. And uh, I have three different piles. I'm using the Edgar Allan Poe tarot deck with uh, the bonus card using the zombie tarot. Isn't that fucking exciting? All right, here are your goddamn choices. Pile one, a knife. Pile two, an inhaler. And pile three, a vape pen. Choose the pile that sears your asshole. Pile one. You have the ten of pentacles. The king of cups. And the two of cups. So you are pretty much like already like financially um, abundant as well as um, just feel a, a, in abundance in general when it comes to the King of Cups, which is someone who is, um, I don't know, they are emotional, yet they don't wear their heart on their sleeve and they don't share it with everyone because you have a reciprocal loving relationship. And your bonus card is, oh, your ass either has been left out in the cold by this situation or theirs is. So I don't know, maybe some communication needs to happen uh, so that you can either resolve the issue or fucking move on. But that sucks. That's an unhappy ending. And uh, I don't know, maybe uh, there's more to the story. Pile two. <laughs> and you have the world in reverse. The lovers in reverse. And the knight of wands. So, um, <clears throat> you haven't put an end to a situation or made a decision about a loving relationship because you kind of just want to fucking be a player and do your fucking thing. You don't, uh, you don't have any intentions of committing to your situation. Ah, uh, I see. All right. So your bonus card is the three of cups, which means like you have a decision to make between two people and you're not fucking making it. So I hope for you, since you're not being an honest person, that both people find out and your ass is left all by your lonesome. Pile three. You have the king of wands. The Six of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. It's very rare that I get a king and a queen of the same fucking suit in a goddamn reading, but hey, you know. Um, so these are two passionate fire signs or have fire in their natal chart somewhere that are... Um, in a reciprocal giving and taking relationship, which is awesome. It's awesome that you've found your match. Let's see what your bonus card says. Oh, uh, no, yeah. the King of Wands. So it's like, you're both passionate and fiery about each other and the same things. So that helps your fucking situation. Um, and, uh, <coughs> excuse me, the COVID cough. But yeah, it's good to have a mutual give and take that you don't have to, uh, you know, necessarily tell a person what exactly it is that you're passionate about. You, you just get each other. <coughs> you're on that equal playing field there. All right, so that's all I have for you fucking cock smokers. Have a lovely day and don't fuck yourselves too hard.